Yeah, this box came in the other day. I'm just now getting around to it, even though I already opened it. But yeah. And it's not a dish HD hopper tuner box thing. Oh no. It's something important. Well, not really important, just something that I've been wanting. Okay, I really didn't really want it, but. Well, I'll explain later. But it seems to be packed okay with that, but. Bubble wrap and tape and all that sweet stuff. I'm gonna do this one handed while holding the camera. I mean, I'll give this solid, you know, give this solid credit for packing it pretty well. <clears throat> I mean, hell. As much as I paid for this, I mean, I want it to be. Okay. I don't want to just come in here all damaged and destroyed and then realizing that I spend a good chunk of money and I'm not going to be able to use it. So... So this is talent right here. Trying to undo a package. And all that. With one hand, mind you. I'm doing this one-handed. Guys are pretty much knowing what this could be. Okay, right. sure people are going to wonder why the hell do I need yet another stinking wall clock when I have like a bunch of them. Hell, I got a pile right there, two right there, one there, several clock radios, and all that stuff. Well, I don't know. This design kind of intrigued me. And uh, if you watch that uh, music video by Rush, uh, the song Subdivisions, um, there's a scene where they're in the bus station and you see this type, of, this exact same clock, Badge West Clocks. And um, I've been trying to find one similar to it, but it's either been too expensive or in really shoddy shape that wouldn't be worth it. But then it's like on eBay, I saw one Badge Seth Thomas, which was an almost mint condition, like it wasn't even being used, or if it was used, it was ve really restored. And sadly, I got outbid. A lot. And then this one, it's like, yeah, well, it's not exactly what I've been wanting, but I figured, yeah, I can use it. And it's not that bad either, so... I think it'll go good with my other West Clocks and Seth Thomas and all that stuff. And all that. Now there are some cosmetic issues, um, mainly some surface rust, paint splatters all over. The time set knob is bent and it's missing the little screw knob at the bottom to help with it with the adjustment because you're trying to turn it with the knob it'll hurt. And this little thing right here, there's a little pin. Well, there's a little stem that goes with it, so when the old power goes out and you reset it, it would have a red dot. But when you push that pin in, the dot would turn white. I think I explained it to another Seth Thomas clock, that uh, Apple clock. So, yeah. So let's uh, hang it up, plug it up, and see what we got. Alright, as you can see, I got this old clock up on the wall, plugged up, 
and running right now. The time is somewhat accurate. With the exception of that one, I have yet to reset it. Same for that one. But you know what? I don't really care. But my main concern was that one. Getting it plugged up. And um, yeah. The face is a little discolored. Kind of like a old photograph. It got yellowed or browned or whatever. I suppose that one's still kind of crisp white. And same for that one. And what you didn't notice, well, what I had to, at the bottom, right above that LED light, that's a quick connect plug. I took off that old Zenith radio, which I'm not using at the moment because, well, I'm just not using it. Thing was, it's like the cord at the plug itself was a little bit um, thin and questionable, and just above it was showing some bare wire. I wasn't aware of it until I plugged it up, and it was buzzing like crazy, like um, like wooden alternator or whatever. It was kind of like conflicting each other, and <clears throat> and just whatever. I mean, I'm just was trying to be safe and stuff. And when I looked at the back, there was nothing on it stating model number and stuff, but I think it's a Manager S18. That's the model number, but I could be wrong. But I do know it's a Manager, and it is made by General Time, and that's all I know. But if anyone else knows about this uh, model, please let me know. Alright guys, that's going to conclude this video of this West Clocks S Manager 18, or Manager S18, or whatever model it is. I know it's a manager, 18 something. I got off eBay for a pretty hefty price, but it was something I've been wanting. Well, not really wanted, just it was intriguing. Well, and uh, as for the General Electric 2912, I have that set aside, and sooner or later I will have a whole wall of these electric wall clocks running. So think of it as this way. It's getting as bad as these fans right here. But who knows? That's just something for another time. So I guess till next time, whenever that is, let's do this. The time box is open.